said, you dumpy teeth, ugly, bog-eyed, rabbit, cat, ugly piece of shit. You are getting knocked the fuck out. And for all the haters out there as well, a massive fuck you. Because they got 70% of the Undisputed Heavyweight Championship. Simon Jordan, you a little bitch. No wonder you lost 100 million, bitch. Wrong business, you little sausage. Joe Parker, we cannot wait. Can't wait. Who's waiting to get smashed? Christy, the strongest I've ever been. He's a monster. I'm a fucking monster. Who's ah! wait? Again, demolished. Get up. <laughs> get up. <laughs> hey, like him, love him, I hate him. It's Tyson the Gypsy King Fury. And at this point, I believe he is just motivating himself with the with the insults, with the lashing out, um, with the tenacity of the verbal spillage that he's talking about Usyk. And he does mention Simon Jordan because Simon Jordan was one of those guys that did doubt him. And, you know, and let me counterpunch. Um, I'll say this, you know, um, Tyson Fury is a showman. Tyson Fury is an unorthodox guy. However, Tyson Fury doesn't fool me. What do I mean by that? He doesn't fool me because when he says he doesn't care what people say, he's lying. You know, I think he cares exactly what people says. He cares what people thinks because if he didn't, he wouldn't have a rebuttal to say or a response after each and every skeptical, uh, subjective thing someone says about him, you know, um, like, uh, like I remember him kicking Ellie sit back reporting out of his, um, circle of interviewers one time, which to be fair, he did, you know, they had some different type of, you know, political shit going on, but you know, uh, Ellie don't like him. That might be the reason, but you know, um, true Jordy is another one. You know, he called him a cunt and, you know, and all this stuff, you know, and, and, and it just shows you it's like, okay, well, you know, things tick Tyson off. So Tyson does have, you know, a, um, a chip on his shoulder. I feel he does. I think he has a chip on his shoulder. I think things do affect him, you know, and I think that's why he lashes out, you know what I mean? Because again, if he didn't care what people think, he didn't care about legacy. If he didn't care about this, that, and the other, he wouldn't have anything to say about those guys that had something to say about him. Now, I, nothing wrong with protecting yourself or defending yourself, but it's a such thing as defending versus deflecting, okay? Because a lot of times people deflect. They don't like to own shit. They don't like to be at fault for anything. They just like the idea of it's everyone else's problem and if you have a problem with me, fuck you. That's, that's the type of uh, attitude that Tyson does come off with some of the time, especially when, you know, when people question, is, is he the best based on the people that he's put to the test? Bars. So, you know, this is just another example of Tyson Fury responding to another person that questioned, you know, does he really want to fight the best? Um, hence, is he the best? But you guys tell me what you think. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been Counterpunch. Peace!